Hey, what's happening gamers? This is John, host of Video Games in the World, and this is Super Castlevania 4. So ladies and gentlemen, we are now in the castle. Our first... We are in the first floor of the castle, which is the Knight's Hall. Oh god, I hate that dog in this one. Ruff, 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 ruff. <laughs> Shut up, you not. Zombies, bats, and dogs. Oh crap. Funny funny thing is he looks like a mouse. It looks like a mouse, but when it gets up, it's a dog again. You take him take it down, it's like a it looks like a mouse. Okay, let's use the uh the holy water on the armored knight. That'll teach him a lesson. Yeah. Okay. I, I just really I really like the music of this game is so awesome. Okay, now we're going upstairs, and you'll see one of the really cool parts that I like about this game. Whoa, that's a big ass chandelier. And I just, and the music in, in this part is so wow. There you go. So this stage is, I actually call this stage like the haunted it ballroom. Cause of course, as you're gonna see, it is a ballroom full of people, ghosts or vampires dancing and stuff or st stuff like that. <laughs> And also, I'm going to show you a secret area in this part of the game. In, in secret areas of, of this game, you find multiple hearts, multiple bags of money, so you can earn some lives. And you can even get pieces of chicken in order to, to heal yourself. Okay, here it is. Let's go downstairs and... Wow, look at that. But be careful with another dog right here. You can kill it or whatever. You can kill it or let it live. Oh, this dog. Oh, it's not gonna make it eat. There you go. Huh, sorry buddy, but, but your dog could have killed me. Well, word of advice, ghosty buddy. If you're gonna have a pet, keep it on a leash. <laughs> and you can also get whatever sub weapons you want, as long as you're getting a lot, multiple hearts and all that stuff, you know. Okay. Beware of the falling of the falling chandeliers. Now you see these are ghosts or vampires if you like. And you gotta watch out for that multicolored stuff that comes at you. <laughs> Looks like a freaking jelly jello roll got on wrong. Ghosts, vampires they are, whatever. Huh, <sighs> just trying to be smart playing smart, you know. Huh, good, a double tablet. Come on. Yeah. Uh-oh. Damn, that shit hits hard. Part of my French. Yeah. Well, at least you don't have to drive a stake through them. Well, when you're a Belmont in Castlevania, who needs a wooden stake like Buffy? At least Simon Belmont has a whip. 
Okay. Buffy uses wooden stakes and sort and sometimes other weapons. As for Angel, he might use a, a wooden stake or a sword. Depending on the situation. Yeah, Joss Whedon did a good job with Buffy the Vampire Slayer, but... But of what I've read about his wife, dude, that's messed up what he did. Yeah, it's a sensitive comment, but... But I apologize if I brought it up. If I brought it up, you know. Because I was thinking about Buffy and all that stuff. When it comes to playing Castlevania and... And all that stuff, you know. Speaking of Buffy, I remember Christy Swanson being the original Buffy. And the funny thing, it, it was like four years before the show premiered. I mean, the Buffy movie was really bad, but... But hey, to many it was pretty bad, but I thought it was pretty cool. And the movie that was lambasted by critics, but still loved by, by a lot of people, it spawned a television series with Sarah Michelle Gellar as the character, Buffy Summers. Okay, piece of chicken. Yum yum. Ugh, the good old Castlevania pot roast. The cool thing about those skeleton knights when, when those things goes hands grab you is that you can kill them with one on head. dancing. Well, inside of those coffins are, are those dancing vampires. Boy oh boy, it's prom night in Castlevania. Stars run. No, not dancing with the stars, it's dancing with the vamp with the vamps. Okay. Ooh, another vampire wants to dance. As much as, as I love to dance, I want I gotta kick Dracula's ass. Once again. Okay, so this is the first boss of inside the castle. Now, the dancers in in this boss battle are called Fred Asker and Paula Abghul, named after famous music artists Fred Astaire and Paula Abdul. Okay, folks, time for me to wrap up this video. So I hope you enjoy the rest. This is John Jose Video Games in the World. So later. <laughs>